Hey, Drop Tech fans! Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into some exciting updates from the 2024 Samsung Developers Conference. You might recall that Samsung recently held the event and confirmed that One UI 7 will be rolling out next year. But there's still no exact date for the developer beta, which leaves us wondering when we'll get to try out the latest update. Luckily, we got our hands on a device running One UI 7 at SDC 2024 and shared some exclusive video previews, showing off some of the major changes that Samsung has introduced. Interestingly, One UI 7 is evolving rapidly, and according to our sources, many of the features have already changed since the version that we showcased in the video. Samsung didn't go too deep into the details during SDC 2024, but they did confirm that a major overhaul is in the works for their custom Android skin. The scale of these changes seems pretty significant, which explains why Samsung has pushed the release to next year. Normally, we would see new One UI versions by the end of the year, but with all the changes, it looks like we'll have to wait a bit longer. Now, let's talk about some of the exciting features that were revealed in the exclusive One UI 7 video Sam Mobile shared from SDC 2024. We saw several updates, including redesigned icons, an overhauled notification shade, revamped quick toggles, a refreshed camera interface, and an updated multitasking or recent apps screen. Even though what we saw in the video was impressive, word is that many elements have changed since then. Samsung insiders have told us that visual elements like the icons, animations, and various parts of the interface have undergone further updates. The internal builds are still a bit buggy, but the team is making steady progress as they release new builds more quickly showing that development is moving ahead at full speed. We'll definitely stay on top of all the One UI 7 updates and share any news as soon as we get it. But for now, we're still waiting for Samsung to officially announce the One UI 7 beta program. According to well-known tipster Ice Universe, or at Universes, One UI 7.0 will mark the biggest leap for Samsung in recent years, especially when it comes to system stability, smoother animations, and more fluid transitions. And here's something even more exciting. Samsung is expected to launch the Galaxy S25 with One UI 7, likely version 7.1, pre-installed. The combination of Samsung's software, the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4, also known as the Snapdragon 8 Elite, and 16GB of RAM will make One UI 7 perform even better on the Galaxy S25 Ultra. Ice Universe even shared his personal smoothness scale where One UI 6 received a score of 60 points, the Galaxy S24 series running One UI 7 scored 85 points, and the Galaxy S25 series with One UI 7 hit an impressive 92 points. Now, while these scores aren't backed by scientific research, they do give us a good idea of how much smoother and more refined each version feels. Upcoming One UI 7 Update Samsung is prepping some major changes to both the aesthetics and functionality of its Galaxy devices, and we're here to break it all down for you. From brand new icons to supercharged widgets, let's dive into what we know so far. One of the first things you'll notice with One UI 7 is the complete overhaul of Samsung's app icons. Not only are they more polished, but the Gallery app has received a facelift, indicating that Samsung is moving towards a more unified, sleek look across all its native apps. But don't think it's just about appearances, there's a lot more going on under the hood. Next up, Samsung is taking widgets to a whole new level. According to IS Universe, these new widgets are richer in features than anything we've seen before. Samsung is really pushing the boundaries here, making their widgets not just pretty to look at but also incredibly functional. Imagine having powerful widgets that enhance your user experience in ways no other operating system offers. Now, I know you're probably wondering, when can I try this out? Samsung is planning to launch the One UI 7 beta program by the end of the year, but it will be a limited release. Only a few Galaxy models will get early access. If you're eager to test it out, keep an eye on Samsung's announcements because this beta will be open to the public. Samsung is taking its time to ensure the software is stable, polishing it through rigorous internal testing. This careful approach means a longer beta period, but in return, we'll get a bug-free and highly optimized experience. Here's where things get a little interesting. There's been some speculation about whether Samsung will release One UI 7.1 after One UI 7. Some reports suggest that Samsung is focusing all its energy on perfecting One UI 7, 
so we might not even see 7.1. The good news? By the time One UI 7 officially drops, it should offer a smoother, more stable experience than ever before. So, when can we expect the final version? According to the latest rumors, One UI 7 is expected to launch alongside the Galaxy S25 series next year. But, keep in mind, Samsung's meticulous attention to detail might mean delays, ensuring that users get the best possible experience. Whether we'll also see One UI 7.1 remains to be seen, but for now, all signs point to Samsung going all in on One UI 7. And while Samsung is perfecting One UI 7, Apple is bringing some serious competition into the mix, focusing on AI innovations that could set off an AI showdown between the two tech giants. But with all of Samsung's efforts in the user interface game, they're pulling out all the stops to deliver a game-changing experience. That wraps it up for today, folks. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that bell icon for more updates on the latest Samsung news and leaks. What do you think about the new icons and widgets in One UI 7? Do you think Samsung will outpace Apple's AI push? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next video. Got some exciting news about Samsung's upcoming foldable smartphones. If you're a tech enthusiast, you'll definitely want to stick around for this one. We're talking about the highly anticipated Galaxy Z Fold 6 series, and more specifically, the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra, which is rumored to be coming to China and Korea. Let's dive right in. Among the many Galaxy Z Fold 6 models in development, the one generating the most buzz is the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. As you know, Samsung's Ultra-branded smartphones are all about offering the best in terms of features and cutting-edge technology. While the standard Galaxy Z Fold 6 will likely bring incremental upgrades, all eyes are on the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. However, there's a catch. The Ultra model might not see a global release, but don't worry, this powerhouse of a device may still launch in China as well as Samsung's home country, South Korea. Rumors suggest that Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra could also launch as the Samsung Go 25 in China, complete with unique touches like decorative engravings on the hinge similar to previous Samsung W-series smartphones. Now, not much is known about what separates the Fold 6 Ultra from the standard model, but it's expected to have a larger display and a slimmer design, potentially launching alongside the Galaxy S25 next year. As for the standard Z Fold 6, we're hearing about a wider cover screen and sharper corners, along with a potential new camera module, changes, and a potential release schedule that could reshape your Galaxy experience in 2024. So, let's get into it. Samsung has announced One UI 7.0, set to launch sometime next year. However, the exact date for the developer beta remains unclear. Traditionally, Samsung rolls out its major software updates toward the end of the year, but things are a bit different this time around. During Samsung's Developer Conference 2024, SDC 2024, we got an exclusive preview of a device running One UI 7.0. While we shared some exclusive footage, the software has evolved quickly, and according to our sources, many features have changed since then. At the conference, Samsung confirmed that a significant redesign is coming for their custom Android interface. The One UI 7.0 update is shaping up to be one of the biggest changes we've seen in years. Samsung is clearly taking its time to perfect it, which could explain the delay in the usual release timeline. In a recent leak, Renowned tipster Ice Universe revealed that several icons in One UI 7.0 have already been revamped. Samsung has redesigned key app icons for gallery, phone, camera, voice recorder, contacts, and notes. The new icons are visually more modern and functional, bringing a fresh look while improving user feedback integration. Samsung is clearly focusing on delivering a more cohesive and polished interface that will improve the experience over previous versions of One UI. According to Ice Universe, One UI 7.0 will be Samsung's largest upgrade yet. It's all about improving system stability, smoothness, and fluidity. Expect faster, smoother animations and transitions that will elevate your overall user experience. Additionally, the Galaxy S25 Ultra is expected to launch with One UI 7.0, possibly version 7.1 and is rumored to perform exceptionally well thanks to the new Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 Elite processor and 16GB of RAM.
The synergy between Samsung's software and Qualcomm's cutting-edge chip will likely make this one of the fastest, most powerful smartphones on the market. One of the biggest updates in One UI 7.0 is the support for Samsung's Home Up app. This new version brings several exciting features that are designed to make your Galaxy device even more customizable and user-friendly. One of the standout features is gesture animation tuning for the home screen. Users can now choose from three different animation styles, ranging from pixel-by-pixel -pixel smooth animations to playful animations inspired by fruits. You can also fine-tune the speed and feel of these animations to suit your personal style. Samsung is also giving users more control over folder sizes. You can now select between medium and large folders, with further customization for the folder grid and icon sizes, making organizing apps even easier. The pop-up folder feature has also been enhanced, giving you small, medium, and large size options. You can fix the position of the folder or remove blur effects for a cleaner, more efficient interface. Thanks for watching, Drop Tech fans. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more tech updates. Also, make sure to click the bell icon so you never miss an update. We'll catch you in the next video. Peace out.